Hij kras, kras. Hoe je bro? Wat zei jij? Ja, lekker dude. Heb je een sky voor mij? Het ik, ja, ik heb een sky voor jou man. Ja, sky voor je niet stuur maar hoog. Hoog. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, hey, wat die? Ja, ja. If, if I agreed with you, we'd both be wrong. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow, dat was goed. Oké, okay, ik heb het voor je. Ja. Yo, mama is zo so fat. I took a picture of her last Christmas. And it's still printing. <laughs> hey, wat die? Ja, ja. It's crazy. We live in a society where pizza gets to your house before the police. <laughs> hey, wat die? Ja. The last thing I want to do is hurt you. But it's still on the list. <laughs> yeah. Let's go. Chris, Chris. Yes, what? Eh? Your mama is so ag- ugly when she tried to join an ugly contest. I said, sorry, ma'am, no professionals. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, what? Eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the, early m- the early bird might get the worm, but the yeah. second mouse gets the cheese. He is still worth gevang, bro. Oh, fuck. Okay. And was life. Let's do it, baby. Here we go. Here we go. Here you. We go. Woop wop! Het is woensdag! Het is woensdag, dude. Vandaag weet ik het niet wat ze dag het is, ou. Dankie toch. Damn. Maar weet je wat? Ik zit en lees al ons commentaar zo. Ik denk ik ja. het een uh, knopje vergeet om te mis. Dat was geen klank niet. So, ja, ja, ja. Ik heb net foto's gekijk, maar altijd als we het doof was. Ja, en ons, ons, ons maak zijn stap was aan. Ek en dan hoor we al ek as hem. Yes. Het is zo ik als jij als ik het uit jouw bek uit doe. Wacht, wacht, laat ik het groter maak, laat ik het groter maak. Zie je slief voor mij, zie je slief voor mij. Ik wissel, hij voor jou. Oh my god. <laughs> what a way to begin, dude. But you Good night, Omo. Good evening, yeah, everybody. Man. Welcome to another night Away. of SA Bros. Here on uh, Wednesday, Woensdag. Oh, guys, <laughs> what a powerful show. We we started with the orgasm. <laughs> Show's finished. Have a good night. Yeah. See you all tomorrow night. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> That's like a slop. Cheers. <laughs> dude, I, I, I've been waiting for this one for a while, man. For non oh. is we are met in from my main sir, Musa. In a, a legend, an absolute dude, legend in the field. Cindy is and I net, love this woman to birth. Oh, yeah, man, she's been there from the beginning. Uh, she's she, her music filled my my youth. This is so amazing, so and, yeah, and it's exactly. still there. You can still play it, and people still go, "Hey, here's my track." So this, yeah. And now we get to speak to the legend, man. Exactly. But before we do it, let's say yeah. hello to all our wonderful people let's out there: quickly, Nikki, yeah. Shawnee. 
Show nie all the way from Kumati Pork Bra. Ons is so blij, het veilig daar aangekom, en dankie vir die videos wat jy vir my en Chris gestuur het. We love you, yeah. brother. Daniela Diogo, Susan, John Pierre, André Burnett, Diewald Johannes Swart, Awe Masse Kinders, Claudia Klute, en my sweet love, Nikki. Um, Oom Dani, hallo Lizzie. Oom Dani, Masse Kind, we, hy is al in die huis, bro. En Loftus, en Tiffy. Loftus, Tiff, ja. Yeah. Welcome, welcome guys, but you know what, that's, yeah. that's you guys, we're gonna be talking to you guys tonight, and Feel free to ask Cindy any questions that you guys want to know. Anything you want. Anything, Anything from back in cloud days to what she worked on with Alta Irving and all the other bands, guys. And she's a rock chick, dude. You can ask her anything. She's proper uh, rock star. Yeah, rock, rock, rock chicks, so they, 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 you can ask them anything. So, guys, so, dude. with absolute no further ado, ladies yeah. and gentlemen, please welcome Cindy Alter. Yes. <laughs> Hello, Cindy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, <laughs> rock chick did you, indeed. Did you Absolutely like that little love. orgasm I just had? It was lovely. I was just living vicariously through you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it when oh, you talk for oh, us. It's love been it. a while. Oh, it's been a while. Okay, guys, like don't don't get me all hot, hot and heavy for nothing. Yeah, come on. <laughs> well, so here's you, a guy who's already saying hi. Uh, let's see you. He says, hi, Cindy, I'm also watching this night to you. So, uh, Marion Warwick. Marion Mar comes from, she runs my fan club in America, in uh, Germany. In wow. Germany. Well, guten Abend, Marion. Uh, good it's a good Marianne. Yeah, welcome. Right. Yeah, welcome, welcome, welcome. That yeah. is so great to have you on our show. All the way from Germany. From Germany, Germany. That, was sad, that was a sad attempt. <laughs> Well, since what what have you been doing in this lockdown? Because obviously you still look pretty much sane. Well, Do I? As, as far as <laughs> I know, you Ish. you look pretty Ish. sane. And this uh, is covering know, the this is covering the lobotomy. I just had a frontal <laughs> lobotomy. I got to wear this got big bandage under here. Whoa, <laughs> guys! What what have you been doing to like stay busy to like just keep your sanity and it, you know. Do, do, Man, all the muses, all of us know that it, 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 this has killed our souls, this stuff. Huh? That's definitely what it's done. This yeah. has been, this is probably something we've never experienced in our lifetime. Daniela, yeah. hi, my darling. <laughs> She's yeah. there. Um, we've never experienced that this is like World War Three with an invisible enemy. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah. 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 we've never had this in our life. Our parents knew sort of war and before that they knew about war but this has yeah. destroyed us um yeah. in so many different ways and of course the music business has just died flat oh, out man. dead like you, you know like you just said with back then there was war but the guys the musicians like the beatles the stones the who and everybody they sang still about playing. war and they could still bring people together now Dude, this war pandemic is music. just wiping out everything you can't yeah. do much yeah, war bred music. Music anything. was written about war and stuff. Of and course. And now, it, everything's so monitored. I mean, if, if you want to sing about corruption and shit now, they'll just <laughs> quickly <laughs> throw your no. shit off, off the show. It's, it's in no Not time it's gone. Yeah. And you're exactly right, because like the Dylans and those guys used to talk about yeah. Vietnam. Yeah. They used to have yeah. a voice. They was no, no, there was no censorship. You know, we, I mean, we, we have no voice right now. And that is yeah. mm. the biggest thing for me as an artist because I've been a, a functioning, playing yeah. musician for like 45 mm. years. Uh, mm. And now what do I do? I sit home and knit. I don't knit. I, I was about to say, <laughs> did you become an old grandma stereotypical and Good. knit? The I rock is to knit. knitting. It doesn't work, up. guys. Look, look, I've always been a bit of a bursian, so I, I did a okay. bit of gardening and stuff. But uh, yes. now I want to go full scale. I want to grow zool. I want to grow medical <laughs> zool. I want to find permits and shit. That's what well, I want to do now. You yeah. can. It's legal. There's certain I'm just going to do it legally. Do. I'm going to go right yeah, down the, the, the right pathways and, and Good boy. go large. Yeah. Let me know when you've got your first uh, harvest. I'll, I'll just let you yeah. Uh, yeah, I'll, just check I'll, I'll it out. Make it sure it's me. good. Yeah, please. Yeah, of course, yeah, because, you know. The inspector, the health inspector. <laughs> I'm the health inspector. And test it properly. The Zoll health inspector. Yes. I've been no. called many things, but never that. 
Now, it's the first what, what for we every do is, love. Um, yeah. Ten minutes before you have that Zol phone us, and we'll set yeah. up an interview then, and then we'll go live ten minutes after the Zol. Okay. Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> Uh, Silly's yeah. awake. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, I've yeah. always been a bit of a hippie anyway. Like to me, everything's about peace and love. You know, that's just yeah. me. And yeah. that's also another thing during this time. The peace and love has gone out the bloody window. Yeah. You know, yeah. everybody's oh, because aggro. Because stuff has been taken away. Yeah. If you, if the, everybody's mad and pissed off yeah. and they want it back and everything. And it's not there. It's just no. not there. So what I, what have I been doing? I've had to start thinking about how do I create a new job for myself, a new career for myself. You know, yeah. I mean, what what, what the hell am I going to do? I've got to stay alive. And yeah. um, I'm digging deep and I'm looking for things and I've got, I'm networking all the time. And yeah. I've got also yeah. a talk show, which I'm really happy of every Tuesday night I do my talk show. <laughs> and I interview older guys, like the guys from the Waybacks, you know, yeah. and we talk about where are they now. And I look at myself in this situation and I say, where am I now? Yeah. Okay, I'm still alive, thank goodness. I'm still yes. singing. I'm yeah. writing a lot of music, healthy, which is great. Yeah. I'm healthy. I'm in the studio. I've got a little bit of food on the table. I've still got a, a roof over my head. Yeah. And yeah. for that, I'm pretty damn grateful. Yeah. Now, Cindy, I wanted to ask you, I, I kept this question aside when you told us off air that you are interviewing the more mature audience. Um, yes. How are you finding it to do it because we are struggling with it and I'll tell you why because we tried with Mel Miller I, I can't do Tony the King there's several of the more mature people we can't interview yeah. just because firstly they don't understand technology and secondly they yes. don't have fiber how have you yeah. been yeah. able to well, talk to these people so far everybody's either had what they needed or gone to a friend you know call yeah. a friend can I can I phone a friend or, and get get hooked a child. up you know or a or child, a or they get the exactly they get their kids to go. Hey man, I'll put it on your phone, yeah. <laughs> you know. Because so we, that, that it night is with difficult. Mel Miller, yeah. With Mel Miller, he sat like this with his phone like this, and he's like, oh. "Whitey, can you hear me?" And then he's like, oh. "Hello, hello." That's... We like your word, Moses Iso. And then thirty yeah. seconds later, hello, hello, <laughs> hello. Very short interview. But I love listen, the Mel Miller to bits. Oh, I man, love him what to death. Listen, no. I started doing that as well. When we had to start all these online shows, I'm like, what the fuck? How am I going to do this? <laughs> Beep. Yeah. <laughs> you know, yeah. and I'm just saying. So I just mm. didn't know what I was going to do. Um, and I had to get real, real quick. Yeah, yeah. exactly. You, you got to get with a program, man. Yeah. Exactly. Look what your namesake is saying. It's so awkward <laughs> yeah. having a guest on with the same name. I know, darling. Different spelling, but still yes. same name. You must be a very cool chick, man. She is she a is. very cool chick, but she's she no rock yeah. star. She but does. it's okay. She, she, Not everybody yeah. can be a rock star, okay? Yeah. We don't all get that one in our lives, you know. But you she put the bar so like high, a man. Rock star. She <laughs> parties <laughs> like a rock star. And obviously, well, you know Daniela. Okay. Daniela's Daniela, an old friend of mine. Exactly. Yeah. She's a rock she's, star. She's, my God. Yes, she is. She's got <laughs> she's the most a, phenomenal <laughs> voice. Oh, my. Yeah. Definitely. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. And 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 I and I'm, I'm sure I, I I taught her how to drink tequila. Uh, was it you? Because <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm a tequila. Listen, I don't drink anything. Okay, I'm not a drinker. Tequila. I don't drink wine. I don't drink no. beer. Don't give me whiskey. Don't give me Jack. No. Give me nothing. Give yeah. me a bottle of tequila, and I'm yours, baby. How's that gold, baby? Wow. Yes, Ice that's cold. good. I scold from Jose the freezer. Gold. Yes, yeah. sir. The squeezer from the freezer. <laughs> That's the now, one. <laughs> Cindy, we, I would love to talk now about the whole cloud thing. Okay. Now, but before we do that, before the, we yes. do that, for our, uh, not, let, not let, let's not say uneducated say listeners, youthful. but the younger, the youth. Youthful, yeah. Uh, this is not to all the youngsters out there. I want to show you a video clip of, Cindy, where she started cloud. When was this yeah. recorded, Cindy? Oh, 
No, you said no. already you've been doing it for 45 years. So you yeah. already threw it out the door. No, I yeah. don't even care. I say my age all the time. People say, well, do you mind if I ask you how old you are? I say, no, I don't mind at all. Because I've earned yeah. every bloody year. And I'll tell you how old I am. I don't care. Yeah. It was recorded in 1978. That's a now year before I was born. I was 21 years old. Boys and girls, do the neither match. Chris, neither Chris or myself were even born. We weren't even. I know that. Up. I wasn't even swimming in the sack yet. <laughs> no, I, I was made in '78. I just came out in '79. But the, the, ah, the, the, so you go. were you I, you were I, the you were the first swimmer out. Yeah, I might have been uh, uh, consumed on 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 substitute. You never know, huh? Maybe. So yeah. ask your parents. Gonna... Ask <laughs> your parents. <laughs> Now, Chris, do me a favor. I'm going to play yeah. the song. Will you just mute your mic? Because there's an echo every time coming through I from will you mute when my we mic, play the man. song. So, guys, I'm going to play you Substitute from Cloud in 1978. Muni Skrikni, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Muni Skrikni. Wow. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> go man well it's such a catchy song even to this date yeah wow dude it's the well, bass line yeah. yeah that's a do 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 once that starts you know and the funniest man. thing guys i gotta tell you yeah. it is still being played 
in South yeah. Africa, in Germany, yeah. in England, yeah. everywhere yeah. in the world. It still it's gets played nearly every single day. It's one of those classics. I yeah. mean, we were number two, number two on the UK top of the pops. You know, it was oh like my. South African band has never done that. And this, and I have to boast a little bit because we yeah. are still the biggest selling South African band. We have sold 17 million albums worldwide. Oh, You can wow. rub that in all these youngsters' faces. <laughs> you go, girl. You go. Wow. But I love the comments, the hairdo, the hair and the man. outfits. Oh, <laughs> hey. Yeah, and, 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 and somebody, I missed it now, said, uh, that they would so wear the pants and everything. And I'm like, yeah. sure. Yeah, you know. That's yeah. Because times, just like, they the... come back. The, the fashion yeah. comes back. And, um, oh, my God, that's these stories that people are showing me. Are, they're so yeah. cute, man. Yeah. And the yeah. thing is also that people remember the time of life when that song was yes. playing. They remember mm. what they were doing. They remember where mm. they were. They were drawling in your brow. They yeah. were chawling in town. We were playing at all the big, like, tuckies and vits yeah. and all the big concerts. I mean, yeah. we were at the Stanner Bank. I mean, there was every, wherever there was to play, we were yeah. there, you know. Uh, oh, here's rough. a good question. He's yes. saying, hey, Cindy, do you find it hard reaching the younger crowds? And Peewe, Matthew, Caveman, Maka. Oh, Sims, what's up? And, yeah, Sims, hey, what's up, man? Hey, yeah. Nice yeah. to meet you. Not at all, because the funniest thing is that I believe music transcends age and mm. everything. So yeah. just because I'm yeah. not singing hip hop doesn't mean it's not a nice song. And, yeah. you know, it's not the coolest thing. I recently did some lectures at the um, Academy of Sound Engineering at yeah. um, the, or, the SABC. Now, these guys are 17, 18, 19 years old. And... Yeah. They went the ballistic. Firstly, when I walked into the room, they're like, yeah, who's this white chicky? You know, who's this yeah. one? Because, I, I oh. mean, it was just a mi totally mixed crowd. There's maybe one white person besides me. Yeah. And yeah. within 10 minutes, they were like, what a story. Yeah. Play some songs. Play some songs. And yeah. I played Teach my us. songs. And yeah. they were up and dancing <laughs> and shouting and loving it because it was music. And it was, yes. it, it felt like music. Yes. Yeah. And it speaks to you. you. Know? It's not this it speaks electronic to you. nonsense. It's not this electronic nonsense that's absolutely got no feeling to it. It's a few buttons you push on a, yeah. uh, on a dub machine. On a loop and that's station. It. That's not music. A loop station, yeah. That's yeah. Music, music we, we all know this, that music has changed incredibly. And there's lots of yeah. people in this oh, world yeah. that love that, what you just talked about. I am still one of those musicians that loves to hear words that mean yes. something to me. Great a lyrics, melody, yeah. a melody oh, yeah. that I can sing along and walk away from it going, uh -huh, uh, na, 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 na. oh, fine. Yeah. yeah, it got to me. And it must touch my soul. Hey, man, I love some it's great music out there, especially in South Africa, some great quieto yeah. stuff and yeah, all the is, new stuff. Really there's great dance stuff. There's really good stuff. And but you know what happens to me? It's the last song that I listen to normally before I get out of the car when I used to work. Or Earworm. <laughs> Can you hear me? Chris? Chris, oh, he's frozen, baby. He's just totally frozen. Well, let him sort himself out and then hopefully okay. he'll be back now. Now, Sidi, what I wanted to uh, show you here quickly is, it's, it's, is um, this is what this meme explains it for me so, so well. Uh, the it's music the back truth. then versus the music mm. today. Mm. Queen was one writer, which was Freddie Mercury, mm. one producer. Mm. No repeats. Mm. Is this the real life? Is this just fantasy? It's, Absolutely. It's 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 one of the best songs ever, ever, ever made. Absolutely. And then you get Beyonce's uh, Run the World. Six writers, four producers to say, girls, we run the mother, yeah. We run the mother, yeah. We run the mother, yeah. Yeah, yeah, girls, we run the mother, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. So <laughs> it's just... It, that, that gets All you got to do is shake your ass to it, dude. And yeah, that's it. That's it. That's, that's, and that's and also me, become... In my mind, that's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Well, things have changed. We know this. Yeah. We know yes. that everybody's looking for a hit. And those yeah. big artists, those big artists like Beyonce and stuff, I listen to them and I go, 
you have to repeat that line 45 times. Yes. You know, yeah. it's like, wow. You know, okay, I understand it. You know, all the single ladies, all the single ladies, all the single yeah. ladies. All, okay, I got it from the first time you sang it. Yeah. Thank you, darling. Yeah. But it's good yeah. music and it's fun and it's danceable. Yeah, look, um, it's beaty and It's so not on. It's memorable. Yeah. Yes. yes. You're not going to in 30 years say, yeah, that song. You're not going to, yeah. in 30 years, now, if you see my arm, it's got Led Zeppelin, Metallica, Kiss, all the <laughs> every way. Every, everything's on there. The if you see my everything. arm too, it's got all those things on it. So, yeah. yeah, yeah. There's, yeah. The, there's the Beatles, <laughs> everything. So. Yeah. Yeah. Cindy, since it's, since it's being Women's Month, you know, don't yes. you think that <clears throat> in today's life that the, the, the music videos, everybody says, you know what, you can't call a chick a... a, 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 a slag or something anymore but oh. then they play in these music videos it's 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 mm. two steps away from freaking porn it is it really is, it is. it's actually and one step and everybody's going you know what we, we we're trying to fight for women's rights and stuff but uh then they personify them so badly and these chicks who are doing it they don't care because they're making gazillions Lots but of yet money. they want to moan the most as well they're of like course, oh anti this double, anti this but they all call hat. yeah it's a double standard you yeah. know what I'm saying? It's like mm -hmm. hypocrisy in its perfect form. It's like, yeah. don't treat me like like a this and a that, but I'm a wearing a bloody, pal, you know, I'm wearing Flange nothing. Curtain, yeah. Flange yeah. curtain. Thank you. I was looking for that word. Um, I was going to call it something else. A pee pee. You know, <laughs> I'm not going to say it. Anyway, exactly I used to look good in a pee, pee but I was 20, you know, and it yeah. wasn't that short. <laughs> but still, it absolutely is that women yeah. are shouting, believe. but in a way, they're also saying, look at me, I can dress how I like, I can do yeah. what I want, and I can own my own sexuality. So we yeah. have to look at it both ways. It's the same yeah. as people used to say, oh, how can women go to and enter these pageants and Miss World and Miss This. Yeah. It's so sexist and it's making yeah. them look like blah, blah. Well, if they yeah. didn't, then who would? Somebody's got to do it, you know? True, but so, here's the thing. is, is If you're wearing a, a low-cut top and your cleavage is sticking out and yes. I'm staring at it, you yes. can't blame me. It, if I no, wore can't. pants that, that – you know, because you can't go full nude. Like you can't see no. the the little brown skin on the thing. <laughs> but if if I go and I wear pants that just show just just half shaft, you know, then, then yes, I'll I be understand. frowned upon. But it's yes. it's it's insane, man. But then but then you double get the standards. No, now yes. it gets worse. Now yes. you get the opposite end of the scale, which is also extreme. You get Lady Gaga. She also likes to wear uh, almost kalhat. But then yes. she does something like this. Look at that. That's her meat suit. I remember Actual that meat. very well. That because was ridiculous. Lady Gaga rules. <laughs> but yeah. that's Look, it. she, she is Listen, great. Gaga does stuff to, 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 to nail a statement. Gaga is the, the smartest yeah, freaking pop chick out there. She doesn't have to do it anymore, have you noticed? Yeah. yeah but but she that's why do she it can anymore. do these but amazing Madonna, and stuff now. Yeah. Madonna still does yeah. it. Yes. Because she... That is, she feels that that defines her. And when yeah. I look at her now, she's had so much work on her face, I can't even look at her face anymore. I look at her body, and is she wearing another leotard in this video? I'm going to vomit. Yeah. She doesn't do it for me. And yes, she was one of the greatest innovators. Yeah. Of, Absolutely. You know, and women's yeah. lib and all that stuff. But, yeah. you know, when you look at girls like Clout, and yes, it was 1978, in those days, women were repressed. Yes. Yeah. Women were meant to literally stay in the kitchen, have the children, barefoot and pregnant in the kitchen, look after the kids, don't go to work. Yeah. And my the, the big man of the house comes home and pose, you know, brings home the bacon. Um yeah. and we girls came out there, this five girls wearing leather pants and mm. this these big perms and long hair. And all the little chicks were going, oh, my God, I want to be like that. I yeah. want to do something like that. We are allowed to do something like that. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you and were we like were pretty, rebels. Yeah, we were big rebels, but we were very conservative rebels when you think about it. You know, yeah. we were really conservative. But it was still – it. It was the start of the women's movement. And when a, yeah. a young woman used to come to me and say, I love seeing you girls playing guitars and playing music. I was like, yes, 
Just know, yes. as a woman and as a man, you can yeah. do anything you want as long as you do things in integrity. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Well, yes, Daniela, she says, some of the songs, namely Save Me, for the longest time sounded like an ABBA song. And I remember growing up and also thinking it was an ABBA song. And I remember funny, being shocked when I heard it was cl a clout hit. <laughs> well, the funniest yeah, just thing more was... Of the hits. Yeah, our, um, our manager and record company, yeah. the record producer, he yeah. had the rights Who was it? for... It, his name was Graham Beggs. Okay. He had the rights for ABBA in South Africa. So he owned the publishing rights and everything. He wanted us to be without being yeah. ABBA, but that kind of thing. I mean, all our stuff was so slickly produced. If you listen yeah. to the cloud stuff, I mean, yeah. the latest stuff, we had stuff with the violins and the string section from ELO, Electric Light yeah. Orchestra. Yeah. You know, yes. it, I mean, we had incredible people on these albums and they were yeah. so slickly produced, you know. So yeah. I think, you know, that even has changed. Production has changed. Um, you know, we could talk about this till the bloody cows come home. Everybody's mm. going to like what they like. Yeah. I personally like music, as you said, got a tune, got words. I love lyrics. I've always been yeah. a lyricist. To me, to write a yeah. song that says something and touches yeah. somebody is the most exciting thing for me. Because exactly. you can see it when you're singing it. You can see when your lyrics actually move people. Now, yeah. Yeah. now, Cindy, yes. talking about that, yes. talking about that, you promised us something. I didn't yes. tell our audience yet. You didn't? Yeah. <laughs> no, I wanted it's to keep a it a surprise. Yeah. I'm going to play on my little acoustic 12-string guitar. Nice. nice. Lacquer. We are getting so spoiled. I love this. Yeah. I'm a zig. Oh, and it's it's got my oh. name on it. Look at that. Yes. Oh. Oh, I'm so trying I'm going to make you angle. bigger now. Oh, I gonna... can see it. And make I'm jealous. Me bigger. I'm, I'm sitting here. I'm like, <laughs> no, oh, hey, 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 not that way, sons. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make me that much bigger, please. <laughs> no. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I've just like been like feeling love lately, you know, even yeah. though it's yes. like very insane times and crazy times and stuff and i've just i just wanted to talk about maybe being moved by somebody mm. coming into your life or something nice you know mm. yeah um cindy's new album thank you quintus i appreciate that very much <laughs> it's a little old now but it's still it's still going it gets keeps getting regurgitated so the song is called all my faith and it's okay. hot off the press. I don't even know the words yet. <laughs> Beautiful. So ladies, yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the altar. Nothing prepares you for this kind of feeling. Loss was a word, just a word now. Something was broken, something was bleeding And it burned right down to the core So I, when I'd lost all my faith Did you come to my door and try to hold trembling hand, I just let you in, so the touch of your skin could be the start of me again. Something has changed, I no longer feel wasted, grief didn't suit me, it blocked out the light. Sweet, it wants to be tasted. My body reaches for you every night. And why, when I lost all my faith, did you come to my door and try to open it? And I, oh, with a 
trembling hands I just let you in So the touch of your skin Could be the start of me again Breathe I'm breathing your air I'm breathing your air I'm breathing your air When I'd lost all my faith Did you come to my door And try to open it And I, oh, with a trembling hand I just let you in So the touch of your skin Could be the start of me again Why, when I'd lost all my faith Giving massive applause Ooh, oh, right thank now. You. Hi, man. And oh, you know what, since goosebumps. just yeah. listening to you, 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 I know why you you were where you were and why you are where you oh. are. You know, some people try and do stuff. You were just born with that, man. You, it's insane. Oh. oh, God. I'm, thank you so I'm much. I'm moved. Thank you so oh. much. You, you're allowing me to breathe here, girl. It's... <laughs> Yeah. Amazing! I Thank breathe you. in your air. Oh, oh. Like the shit! Flight. That was so, so good. I need to smoke now. That's <laughs> yes. Yeah, the people are Thank going you. absolutely nuts. So oh. Thank you, Sandy. That Thank was you so wow. much. Wow. And, was... and you know you. what? I know uh, Brad. He grew up here in South Africa. He's over there, like a live Brad, concert. He's what in a treat. the USA. <laughs> he's in the states. Hey, so uh, where yeah, where so, about is he? Where about he in the states? He lives in Columbus, Ohio. Columbus, oh, cool. Ohio. Okay. I'm from LA, baby. Can you believe yeah. it? From Los Angeles. California. Wow. Well, <laughs> yes, these people, since these people where did you travel wild, all but... over the world? Because when Cloud hit it, obviously mm. back then, you know, you guys could travel the world and see everything. And you were one of the, one of the biggest acts in the world. Where yes. did you go? What was your favorite place to go to? Germany was amazing. Okay, because yeah. they are such rock freaks, you know. Yeah. And um, hey, Lenny and Michael. Oh, these friends of mine, they Ireland. moved from Ireland. Oh, man. Thanks for that's, coming to see me. Yes. I appreciate oh, awesome. it. Welcome, um, guys. So, welcome. Um, I was very lucky in Cloud, like as a 21 year old girl, to suddenly go overseas. And also remember, apartheid yeah. didn't allow anybody to go anywhere or come here. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Every we were all boycotted, yeah. all the yeah. sanctions, boycotts. So when we went into the top bloody twenty in in England, in the and world, then the top yeah. ten, and then the top five, and all the record companies over there saying you've got to bring them here. They have to come and do our TV shows because in those days there were these big TV shows. So anybody who yeah. had hits, so we'd yes. go on a TV show, and there was Van Halen and Kiss. And oh. the police and Gloria Gaynor oh. and the village oh. people, why MCA <laughs> and oh, and and anybody Blondie, the Buggles, I mean it's oh, Super God. Tramp, anybody God, you no. can imagine. We would get up and do our show, and then we'd get off, and Sting would walk up and go, "Hi, how you doing?" And we say, "Cool, Hi. man. You know how's oh. it?" Like, <laughs> so, I'm, I'm trying to master ten trick six, oh. and you look like an amazing experiment. Please. <laughs> Oh, yeah, wow. South African yes. chicks, yeah, baby. Yeah, <laughs> oh well God. done, well done. And, and, so and how did you guys cope with that, John? You know what? I mean, of course, it was so exciting, um, firstly, to leave the country, to get on a big plane, and to go firstly to Germany, to Holland, mm. to France, to Sweden. 
I mean, that was mainly our kind of thing. We ended up in the Canary Islands doing a big photo shoot. It was ridiculous. I mean, they took us there with this yeah. very famous photographer. They put us on camels in the desert. <laughs> I mean, I swear, you don't understand. Yeah. They put us in these big, like, harem, white, cloudy things lying on the sand. I mean, they took such advantage of the fact that we were five chicks. It was hysterical. Yes. But anyway, we had – I was introduced to a lot of things that I'd yeah. never experienced in my life. I was 21 <laughs> years old. I was a kid. I mean, yeah. we walked on the Reeperbahn. You walk, you know, you go to walk in the main roads in in Amsterdam and there's yeah. chicks in the windows selling themselves. It was yeah. phenomenal. It was so yeah. interesting. It wasn't like, ooh, ah, oh, nee, you know, Steffi, yeah. oh, this is my babies, my darlings. I went on tour last year to Germany and they were yeah. my hosts and i worked with rolf her husband he was yeah. my guitarist they took oh. me there they brought me there it was just amazing yeah. i'm so happy to see them oh my gosh oh, um man. so i've traveled there and then of course um after i went to live in la i lived in yeah. in los angeles for 15 years and yeah. of course from there like you know hawaii and mexico it's easy to yeah. get around and then yeah. back to back to south africa i've been in south africa for 15 years now as well what brought you back? Yeah, very good question. Um, yeah, I know. I'm very lucky. I've got an American passport, so I could go. I could go if I wanted to. But what happened? Yeah. Um, I'm sure most of the people know my story. But I got leukemia. I was very sick. I was mm. dying, and yeah. I had to have a bone marrow transplant to save my life. Otherwise, I was going to be overs. And yeah. after that, I looked at my life and I thought, okay, what do I need right now? After having such a big scare and such a big cosmic slap. You know, when the universe just goes, kadunk, either you yeah. wake up on the floor of the toilet with somebody bloody doing a dump on, on, the, on the seat and you say, okay, I'm going to stop taking drugs now, or, mm -hmm. you know, you don't wake up at all. So yes. that was my real wake up. I was never drugs or drink or anything. It wasn't that. So that was my like, Cindy, what do you want? And I yeah. knew that I didn't want to be married anymore. I, I never wanted to be married, but I was married in America to a, a nice guy. Wasn't terrible. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's just that's, that's good to know, yeah. <laughs> wasn't terrible. It just yeah. wasn't, you know. Meant to be, yeah. Just... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and, then, um, and then I also knew that I wanted to not compromise. Yeah. You know, no compromising. Mm. And so I got divorced and I thought... If I go back to South Africa, I can put Clout back together as a reunion just for fun. People know who I am and I can get some work and I'm weak. I'm so weak yeah. right now because from this yeah. transplant and being so sick, I was very ill still. Yeah. And I knew I could at least get some work and people knew <sighs> me. I've got a brother and a father here. So it's not yeah. like I was going to be isolated. Learn, yeah. And that's why I came back and I, I was meant to. This was a good, good growth spurt for me. Yeah. This was good for me to come back. And I've met guys like you and I've met people like I'm talking to on the on 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 the messages here. And and yeah, this is yeah. what I was meant to be doing. And if I go back, I go back. But right now I'm here. Well, you know what? I, th I think the big dude knew that we needed more of Cindy Alter. That's that's <laughs> all it comes down to. Yeah. And uh, obviously, oh. you just needed some African sun because this wow. something about Africa just it, it heals you. It yeah. really makes you strong. Africa is not Absolutely. for sissies. And exactly. It's not. Yeah, it, it'll either heal you or kill you. It's it's the yeah. same as anything else. But Africa will heal you or make you stronger or it will kill you. No. Well, it definitely no. healed me, and yes. I had to. I had to just stand up and just let it take take its hold. You know, yeah. I've got a lovely question there. Describe what you thought the first first time I stood on a big stage in front of thousands of people. It was terrifying, because yeah. I'd been before Clout. I'd done, I'd done a few big shows. I used to open for Bobby Angel. I did some good big yeah. tours. I, I was a kid. Country. I was like yeah, eighteen. Yeah, yeah. I loved country music. You know yeah, that. Still. It's the uh, very much, very much. Yeah. And 
I remember the first few times was in that kind of like 500, 600, 800. But when it hit Germany and we were playing for 16,000, 45,000 people, then I had to gr put my big girl panties on, let me yeah. tell you. Because mm -hmm. you can't go out there and show any kind of yeah. weakness. No. Yeah. you got to go out there and balls to the wall, baby. That's it. That's now, it. Now, Cindy, that's a very good answer. Now, I've got, I asked you something before we went live. Now, I'm yes. going to try and push my luck. You said you love uh, country music. Yes. Now I'm going to see if I can push my luck because I'm with Tim Hill on this wall. Is there oh! any chance? Okay. Who's Tim Hill? <laughs> Tim. Tim has been my PR and media agent for the past yeah. five or six years. Not only that, he is my dearest friend. He is. Oh. He's looked oh. after me. You know when somebody's got your back? Yeah. You know, I haven't I haven't had a lot of those people. You One would think I've had good managers and good blah, blah. Not. I have done mm. most of this on my own because of these bad managers out there. These people that want to yeah. use you and Sneak abuse and you and take you and steal your money. Because the Clout story is famous. Clout had yeah. sold 10 million records in 1981. By 1981, when we broke up, 10 million records and we each got 10,000 rand. Hey. What? Yeah, what? that was the story. Oh, so That in today's money would have been... Yeah, fortune. Now... To get back to oh, my question, uh, before, but before we go back to what I wanted to ask you guys, all the okay. new people, please, uh, come on uh, now, do it quickly. Like and subscribe come our on. page for more great <laughs> interviews like yeah. this. Trust me, we chat to the only, the absolute cream of the crop, the absolute best. We pr we don't speak oh, yeah. to Pity Passos. He's famous, no. but not Cindy Alter famous, <laughs> no, guys. Not Cindy Alter famous. Now, Cindy, Holy what is oh. the chances we can get? Should I? Get you, can you play Jolene for us standing so people can see you play the guitar? Or must I play the video? I vote live. I, I could I could play it, but I, standing is another story. I have to go and get my strap and my la 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 la. I we could can only, sit and play. But I can sit and put the camera a little bit down. Be before sure. you do that, yeah, I, I, I need some guitar porn because how many guitars <laughs> have you got now? Um. I'm, I've got two beautiful electrics. I've got a Fender Strat and I've got yeah. the original. Clout was sponsored by Tama. Yeah. And I was given an Ibanez Gibson 59 copy, solid oh wood my. body. Yeah. So I've Jumba. still got that guitar. Jumba. Oh. Beautiful, oh beautiful my. guitar. <laughs> and I've got four acoustic guitars. I've got two 12 strings and two beautiful uh, six strings. They're like boyfriends string. awesome. you could just put they down. Are. Right? The mine's, mine's Listen, like girlfriends. It's, you they're just the best because they, you put them down. They don't give you any cuck. They don't want to be fed. They don't yes. want. When you're tired and you come home from a, a late gig yeah. and you're exhausted, they don't say hello, cookie. Yay. They say nothing. Nothing. <laughs> oh my. Okay, that's 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 can enough guitar porn. I'm already yes. drooling here. Can, Maybe can you see me now? Yes, yes. Here we go. oh yes. Oh, guys, so you are blessed for a second time tonight. So give us much love and energy towards Cindy for playing you a yeah. second song live. She'll Just feel it. it we'll, 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 yes. Let's make our girl big, dude. Wow. There you go. Thank yeah, you. Baby. Um, well, Alter Irving was a band I was in for a while. With Stuart Irving he used to sing with yes. Belly U way back in the day. And yeah. Stu and I had a fantastic country duo. And we recorded the song. It's a Dolly Parton song, as everybody knows. But <laughs> Julie, 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 Julie. I'm thinking of you. Please don't take my man. Nothing I can do to keep from crying when he calls 
your name Julie And I can easily understand You can easily take my man But you don't know what he means to me Julie Julie I haven't sung it for ages. I'm, I'm like the other, get it. I also, I haven't sung it. Everybody can sing it with me. Chorus. Jolene, 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 Jolene. I'm big enough, you please don't take my man. Sounds uh, like that sold 10 million copies, baby. <laughs> Eat it. Oh. But I buggered up the bloody words, man. For it doesn't, it doesn't matter. matter we had the Joel. We had the absolute oh Joel right there. <laughs> now I'm thinking of every Jolene I've ever known. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's all good. I didn't know them like that. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Says you. <laughs> <laughs> Says me. <laughs> oh. Oh, Daniela, oh, thank you. to catch up. Thank yeah, you. one Daniela. time, Daniela. We, we do agree. We would love to catch up with all you guys. And I cannot oh wait. God. Cindy, um, we've, been, we've been chatting about this now for a couple of weeks to have a SA Bros reunion party where okay. everybody that's been on the show, we get together and we have the biggest, sickest, Festival. mother beeper, fucking jaw. Party. Sorry for the word. I'm trying <laughs> yeah. not to swear, but. A party. Trying. And You're trying very you hard, I know. Yeah. You're definitely oh, yeah. gonna be there, and it's gonna it's just to catch up and be with people. I'd love yes. to be there. Would you invite me? Uh, hell, what are you of talking course, about, yes. girl? You, we, we're gonna set up your super tent. VIP. Yeah, <laughs> you'll have two studs rubbing oil all over you every night. Oil, yeah. I love oil. Yeah, oh, oh, candles must I make my noises stuff. again. <laughs> no, we, oh, so we got the message. Know. We got the message. Thank you, Whitey. I've got enough to think about tonight. All right, thank you. Yeah. Well, my angel, you know what? Like I told you, the uh, hour just flies by, man, and it sucks yeah, because yeah, yeah. we're having such a duel with you. Oh, I can't time. believe you know what? I don't know how Whitey does it. Like I, I know you, but I don't know you. But now I know you. You know. And you and knows me once again. I know you. you, man. You know we play <laughs> together and things, but that's, hey, and, and once again, you know what? We, we've been blessed by, by yeah. another great, 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 great star, yes. just giving us a couple uh. of minutes. And 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 you know what? For Ladies Month, this is a total blessing. Yes. This is the gift so, of gifts. So <sighs> absolutely, absolutely right. Thank say you so what much, Chris. Chris. Yeah, and oh, so what, from the heart, my love. <laughs> wow, place. Cindy, give us some womanly inspiration and words yeah. of wisdom for the. What ladies can you say to the, the ladies generation. out there? Yeah, Stay. please. You know, being a lady myself. <laughs> yeah, thank goodness. Um, 
<laughs> I just, I think women need to own their womanness without having to shout about it. Yes. We don't have to take the placards into the streets and scream, women's rights and women's this and women's this. Just do it. Like Nike yeah. says, just do it. Just do it. And that's what do I it. believe. You just do it and you do your thing and you just get in there. You don't have to scream and shout and, and, and say, look at me, listen to me. Don't treat me like this because I'm a woman. Yeah, 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 yeah. It just gets you the wrong kind of attention. That's yeah, my opinion. Yeah. Opinion only. Thank well, you so much. You know what? There's words of wisdom from uh, from not just an amazing lyricist, but from a woman with so much life experience. And, yeah. and, and, and that's just gone to, through uh, everything. Yeah. I think if we sit around a fire, the, the stories that'll come out, yeah. especially the the, the, the the dirty stories. I, I, I can't oh, yes. wait to speak to you about that, Kak. That's I the can't. stuff yeah. I really Oh, my God. Hear. I've got two That's... very good stories that I can never tell. One is about the Albanian, don't ask, yeah. and one is yeah. about the paparazzi. So we can talk about those next that, time. That, <laughs> I remember that. That does that. Yeah. That's I remember that when I, when, when I get you a tequila, since. Yeah. A couple of tequilas a and couple. then I talk. Oh, no, we, we're going we're gonna <laughs> to polish that stuff, I promise you. Ooh, but, babe. Angel, I've got to say thank you for your time. Yeah. Thank you. We've been blessed. And, and yeah. thank you for just being you and just for, you know what? And, and thank a, the big dude for like, saving you. Yeah. yeah, just being you guys, an amazing. Thank you so much. I don't know what to say. And I've had the most beautiful experience with all the people that are on here tonight and my friends also that have come to see me and Daniela, Tim, Marion, Rolf and Steffi. They, they also from Germany, by the way. Yeah. And yeah. I'm just so That's grateful all. to all the new people that I'm sussing here and Nikki and Sean and Jackie and Susan and yeah. all the people that I've spoken to today and Cindy. <laughs> yes. I just want to say thank you so much for your love and your support. It, it's without you guys out there supporting us, we, yeah. we are nothing, honestly. So, yeah. big, big whoops to you, all of you. Woohoo! Yeah. Well, Angel, <laughs> I hope you have a phenomenal time. We can't wait to see you after this lockdown. And Me we're going to make it totally worth your while. Ah. Once again, you know what? We love you and, and keep yeah, blessing us so with much, your voice and, and just your love. Oh. Thank you Look for having yourself. me, you guys. Thanks, oh. Whitey, for pulling out that old phone book and saying, have I still got Cindy's number in there somewhere? The black book. My dad <laughs> always referred to it as his little black book. Black Looks book. Those little black book. <laughs> Thanks so much, everybody. Bye-bye, Bye, Bye. Bye, everybody. Bye. Cheers. Bye. Wow. Dude, what a show. Weet, jy, weet jy wat humble my is, is a humbleness. Is, 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 is yeah. nog steeds, she's the most humble, loving woman. Yeah. I'm, I'm stunned. I'm, I'm blown away. It, it, it's been a while since I had to, could hear somebody else sing for me. Weet jy wat, ek moet mm. vertrooi, uh, uh, ek moet vertrooi big ups om uit my herinner om vir Cindy te bel, want ek het hier gesit en ons, ons het gesels en gebreinstom we can yeah. cry and all us and to say what from Cindy Akis, yeah. But what she wants more love, she wants more love. There you go. There's more love for you. More love. Oh, I love you, babe. Thank you, sweethearts. <laughs> you are well, absolutely amazing. I love you guys. Uh, Anytime, thank man. Thank you, Ooh. Bev. You know, oh. there's another friend of mine, Beverly. Thanks, my darling. <laughs> Uh, well, See, it, check here. It's not going to stop. What Sean is saying. He's saying, <laughs> here is the top interview for me. It was stunning. We form oh my gosh. Him. With 50 odd interviews, and there you go. Save the best oh. for last, eh? <laughs> thank you, thank you, everybody. Jeez. Oh, and wow. then Man. Daniela's here. She said she did an original song with me in one take. <laughs> it was amazing. Yeah. Man. Oh, Daniela. Uh, I'm stunned for love words you. Here, since people it's, love it's, you. It's, it's, yeah, the, the, the moment, you know what? When, when people meet you, you, you Cindy. But when, when I hear Cindy. the stories <laughs> about your life and everything, it's like, it's surreal. You, 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 yeah. you're such a star. It's it's insane, and you're still so <laughs> humble and beautiful. I love it. It's. I don't believe we own lesson. anything. You know, honestly, yeah. I just don't believe we own anything. It's like you're a star. What does that mean? I am yeah. a human being that was yeah, given yeah. these amazing gifts, and if I don't share them, then what they're gonna, what's gonna happen to them? You know, exactly. I'm just gonna yeah. share well, it. I'm just like a messenger. So, well, it's keep all cool. pouring it on us. Nice. 
Keep oh, okay, fine, giving you know us what? that sugar, baby. I've never been pushed so much for uh, for more f from somebody. Tell yeah. us about your book quickly. Actually, you know what? It's our show. We can do what the hell we want. So yeah, we can, tell we us can about your book. I'm talking, yeah. <laughs> wow. Talk, um, tell us. So I wrote, oh, let me tell you. I've got a picture. I've got a book right here. Yeah. yeah. Let's see. No that was no me. Yeah. And that's me too. Um, yeah. So the book's called No Substitute, yeah. Um, it is available on Amazon as a digital book, and I sell hard copies as well. I wrote about my life. I started writing um, when I was living in America because people kept saying, geez, you've got such a story. Yeah. But it wasn't ready to be written yet because I still had more things to do. And yeah. um, I just started taking notes and pulling in pictures and thinking of ideas. And I had a little notebook and blah, blah, blah. And finally, Tim Hill, who I was talking about yeah. earlier, said to me, right, now i got to finish this book. You've got your notes and you've done this and you've done that. Come yeah. on. Thank you for that, guys. Thank you. Sure. Um, and she, you know, just just finish it now. I'm, I'm putting a deadline. We are going to be going for release on this date. We're going to be doing our interviews on this date. I was like, oh, my God, he's really pushing me. But yeah. I sat down on this very chair where I am in front of this very computer, mm -hmm. and I wrote the book. I finished it. I put it all together. Uh, uh, another author helped me get the skeleton. David Cashel, he was so amazing. And yeah. – I just wrote the book because I thought if anybody can get anything out of this, that's all I want out of it. You know, that anybody Beautiful. gets some inspiration. I mean, this the crazy yeah. rock and roll lifestyle from a normal sort of childhood to the mad rock and roll lifestyle to an abusive relationship with a man for eight years that I couldn't get out of to leaving, going into America to yeah. uh, cancer to whatever and 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 just all the stuff and everybody's experienced something like that you know mm -hmm. it's not awesome. just like i'm the only person that's ever had these feelings or well, these people experiences. can relate yeah people yeah. relate and they read it or they hear a song of mine they go my god that song touched me you just said yeah. something yeah, in me, there yeah. it means something to me yes. and if mm. i can be inspirational then i know i've done my job because i think this is nothing to do with religion or anything but i being of service is a beautiful thing in this yeah. world. Yeah. People Through take and take and people take. People succeed. Yeah. Yes, absolutely. Well, Simple as that. Just listen to the wisdom coming from the ginger there. This is, this is great. Can you Aish. believe this? The soulless, the soulless monster that can say through inspiration, um. people succeed. <laughs> That is beautiful. Thank you, Whitey. I'm, I'm getting blown away by both of you tonight. What the uh, hell is happening here, man? He's it's showing his true colors. He's not yeah. such a soulless monster after all. I'm a big soft pudding. Look, you he's are. My teddy bear. Pudding. I, I love him. So he's, he's my teddy bear man buddy. I've, I love, love this him. guy. But both of you, just you, just the way you've just handled this and, and the way you are, it's such a gorgeous interview. Thank you so much. Thank you. Really. Oh, thank, thank you, you. Sandy. Thank you, everybody. <sighs> Man. So, guys, okay. now for final time. We love okay. you, Cindy. We Go love, we love you. The rest of I love night. you, Cindy. And we'll chat, you, we will chat uh, to, uh, mo tomorrow or so about next week, Tuesday. Let's see yes. what yeah. we can do. Please. Send me, that send would be me great. Uh, your friend's number and we'll chat. Maybe we can do, do it. it. That yeah. would be awesome. Thank you, because these people would love that show. It's a similar yeah. kind of show with people from the old days from the industry, and they will just love it. Awesome. So let's see what we can do. I'll set it up with your colleague, and we'll get uh, we'll, we'll make it happen. I reckon yes, we we'll can. Thank you. Man. Absolutely. Cindy, have a and wonderful night. All thank the best you. to you. Love you so much. Love you bye guys. Bye. Bye -bye, Cheers, love. everybody. Cheers. Bye. Bye. Cheers. Dude. Yes. Woody, I can't be yellow on but I'll prod. Be yellow on. I really want to just get hooked, like drunk with her on a bottle of tequila. I think I'm so. Like, I could like her lock say so on the aftergrot. I could. Yeah, I could so fuss up my die, girl, dude. I could so. Man, I, I'm, I, I've had I'm the privilege now. to hop fuss and set the chat with in the past to. Yeah. Uh, uh, the shows and stuff we've done yeah. but that's a that's a conversation for another night guys we need to wrap up 
tomorrow night we've got Lana Sinclair. She's a yeah. motivational speaker and about women empowerment and everything. So she is there for you ladies to chat to you and do everything. And then Friday night, boom, guys, we've got Ross from Prime Circle. We, I think we're the one. first people to interview him after his COVID secret sessions um, uh, uh, show on Saturday yeah. night, which a lot of you guys watch, which was absolutely amazing. And we only have him for a half an hour, but I but might then. have sourced us a second person to be confirmed uh, yes. tomorrow that he can make it. And if he can make it, guys, you must Dude. not miss out on Friday night. Friday is so, going to be crazy. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's it, and then afterwards we're on Twitch again, live DJ and going absolutely nuts. <laughs> and again, guys, to all the new people uh, that joined us from Cindy's yeah. side, please remember to like please, yeah. and subscribe. To please catch do it, more guys. We need your brilliant. support and love, man. And you know what? We have been growing at an amazing rate. Yes. Uh, and it's all because of that, you guys. <sighs> yo, dude, that Casalinga video I just checked: ten thousand three hundred views. So, yes, guys, if you haven't watched the video, if you heard the rumor about Casalinga, no, they are not close. Sunday Times, yeah. everybody got it wrong. Chris yeah. and I went there yesterday. We thought we were going to go have a cry video of yeah. where we're going to go. Oh, come here, Casalinga is gone. We get there. There's cars everywhere. People having lunch. It's just that we're like, what's going on here? And they're like, it's yeah. nonsense. Because uh, 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 one part of the well, of Casalinga did close. The yeah. Casalinga Ristorante Italiano that See. part did close, but yes. they did replace it with something else. And yeah. when when whoever got that leaked letter, that letter was just meant for the staff. Yeah. And obviously, people always add their own flavors and spice and rip it the whole story. It shows you how quickly this pieces. stuff just gets out of hand, watching. So, Casa Linga is not closed. If yeah, and it's not kind of lingus. It's, video, yeah. it's there. It's still yes, there. Casa still Linga there. is open. Please support the place. We love yeah, the place. And the uh, pizzas are amazing. Yes, and, and I've done so. I've personally done shows there. I've gone to watch Prime, Fe Prime Fest there. I've done yeah. for years and years and years I've been there. But guys, thank you so much. Chris, see you, see then. Yeah, you know what, guys? Look after each other. Listen to each other. Love each other. Love and each you know other. what? Tonight, yeah, just phone somebody and say hello. You might change somebody's life. Yeah. And we love you more than friends. Guys, Bye -bye. have a good one. Bye. Bye. Well, goodbye, everybody. From SA Bro.